the chromatozone rag. I'll do the right hand first. pretty good. I know I'm not very consistent with holding out my notes for measures 1, 5, 9, and 13. So I guess this time I'll focus on that for the left hand. So here I go. I'll do the right hand. Mainly just focusing on getting the correct notes. <clears throat> Okay, I'll do it one more time, a little bit more at tempo. I know I missed up on those 5 through 7 because I didn't play C sharp at the beginning. So I'll focus on that for this time. <clears throat> I know I'm missing the last note too, so I'll just start at five and make sure I get the right last note. So it's a G B D so There you go. So now I'll try to just do one to seven and make sure I get the right last note. Hmm. Also, I'm not adding the right notes for I'm playing this instead of this for the second beat of measure three. So I'll focus on that too. And here we go. better um hmm. i guess i'll run it one more time for the beginning and then i'll work on my scales again at the end so i'll just do one to 17 again for the right hand um i guess i can try doing the rag style so Okay, so I'll try doing rag style this time instead of the steady beat from 1 to 17. But there's just a little 
little trickier than I thought for ragtime, so I'll slow it down. So this is measure seven, then I'll slow it down. So I'll start at the beginning again after I do this one more time. I'll go a little bit slower with the rag time at the beginning. Measure 15, just the run, making sure that I'm doing 1 3, 1 2, 1 3, like so the correct fingering. So. Okay, so I ended on the right note. Now I'll just do it one time straight time and then I'll try to do the rag tempo. So. Now I'll do the same thing, but try to do it the jazz style. I'll do it one more time, just a little slower tempo. Okay, I'll do it one more time at the right tempo. Still measure 15. Okay, um, I will run that one more time, just making sure it's consistent, and then I'll do the left hand, and then I'll do the scales one more time. So. fingerings. So I just do it a little slower, just 1 to 17. I'll just do left hand one more time from the beginning. that's the end of my video um i think overall it improved there's still some times that i play the wrong note i think because of just muscle memory from playing the wrong note from the from this to here because i've been doing just a random note so i just have to make sure i focus on that same thing for when i play the second beat i need to make sure i'm playing g sharp and d because i've been doing i 
believe F sharp and C, which doesn't fit the chord. So I have to make sure I play the right notes there. Because it should be. But overall, I think I improved, and then I'll keep working on my scales. Thanks.